Well, only 2% of Americans are farmers. In this report, the Monitor's Ryan Nakan shows us how Bleckley County in central Georgia hopes to pass on their ag traditions to the generations who are becoming more and more disconnected from the farm. Through many dangers, toys and snails, all of us have already come. But it was great that brought us safe thus far, and grace will lead us home. Like a prayer from a Baptist minister, all are affected by the passion of a farmer. And as more of the population detaches itself from rolling pastures, preaching the book of agriculture becomes a necessity. Amen. At a recent ceremony in Cochrane, Georgia, the Bleckley County Cotton and Peanut Museum opened to show a community just how far they've come. I can remember growing up, seeing a lot of these uh, photos here of cotton being picked by hand to modernizing up to equipment today from the one row cotton pickers up to the today is six row cotton pickers. Shaded and centered under these brick columns, the museum focuses on days of plowing with a mule, picking cotton by hand, or hard labor that we now take for granted. And it honors those farmers whose blood, sweat, and tears are what built the foundation of this community. It's important because it uh, preserves the uh, heritage of uh, the cotton and peanut farmers. They helped to make this community what it is today. This museum was made possible with a $98,000 grant from the USDA that was almost lost because the prior site for the museum was condemned. But with swift action in a new location, the county was able to keep the money and build this memorial observing and educating about farmers' past. One of the things I want to see is this to be a, an educational tool to, uh, for the school kids to come here and, and see what their parents and grandparents uh, did back in the day. Our kids are about two generations away from the farm today, so they have no clue about how you plant seed in the ground and it comes up and produces fiber or cotton or peanuts, whatever you plant. But uh, we really need to educate our kids so they'll understand how farming is and the situations that farmers go through every year. The city of Cochrane and Bleckley County would also like to see this museum as a foundation to grow and to a site that people will come and visit. I hope it's going to become a, a tourist destination. I hope some people will actually come to Blakely County just to see this. Uh, because agritourism is becoming a, a, a bigger thing in Georgia. And it will send agriculture and farmers in the right direction for generations to come. Blessing everyone like the sounds of amazing grace. How long, how long, at life indeed. For the Georgia Farm Monitor, I'm Ryan Nockhan.